Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we will learn how to install macOS Ventura on VirtualBox. So the steps are pretty simple as for the previous versions of macOS. So all you have to do is download the macOS Ventura IOSA file from our website. So you can simply browse to techrichard.com and now you can search Ventura IOSA. So you can see this blog post and you can simply click on it and download the files. These are the download files, download links. So once you have downloaded, the next step is to simply open your virtual box and click on new and you can type in macOS 30 or anything that you like. And I'm changing the destination to my G drive followed by next now you can increase this memory size to this green limit followed by next and now click select create a virtual hard disk now click create select vmdk next select dynamically dynamically located followed by next and you can simply increase the size and click create <coughs> now you have to click on settings in the system second settings you can increase your base memory to the green bar and you can select checkbacks on network under processors you can increase it to 4 now go to display and increase your video memory now go to storage select this empty click on this disk and choose a virtual disk and now you can simply select the file that you have recently downloaded so i'm using this file and click open now you can check all this other and you can simply choose USB 3.0 and click OK. Now you have to copy these VM box codes. So since my virtual machine's name is macOS 13, so you have to replace this with macOS 13. So as you can see, now you can simply copy this, click on start, search CMD, right click, run it as an administrator. Click yes and simply paste those codes you can simply use ctrl v to paste those codes now you can close your virtual box machine and again start your virtual box and now simply click on start now you have to wait for a while until your mac os 13 boots up You don't need to press anything, just hold on to it. Now you can see that your macOS Ventura has booted. Now you can simply select your language, click next and you can see all these options, install macOS beta 13, disk utility. So we will go to disk utility and click continue. Now you can simply click on your hard disk and click erase. Select this to macOS extended and name your drive. Say macOS 13 by techreacher.com and click erase. Click done and you can simply close this. Now you can simply select install macOS 13 beta and click continue. Click continue.
once the process is completed now simply select english click on install mac os 13 beta click continue and you can simply proceed with your installation Simply accept the terms, click on agree, select your drive and click continue. And now you can see that the setup has proceeded and it will take around 30 minutes to run your Mac OS 13 beta on your virtual box. So that's it for today. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Do like, share and subscribe.